An ancient dried up lake bed on Mars may be teeming with opal gemstones, a new data from NASA's Mars Curiosity rover suggests. Beyond giving the cracked surface of, of Mars's gale crater a semi precious glint, these opals could be evidence that water and rock have been interacting beneath the Martian surface much more recently than previously thought, improving the prospects that microbial life once lived there, according to a study published December 19th in the Journal of Geophysical Research Planets. Scientists often focus on water when searching for signs of extraterrestrial life because it's critical for life as we know it. But because water no longer flows on Mars, scientists must hunt for geological signs of water that once existed there. These signs are present in the red planet's rocks and soil, where certain minerals and structures form only where rock and water have been interacted. Researchers spotted one such sign in the past few years around fractures in the Martian surface. Surrounding some of these fractures are halos of lighter colored rock, which researchers found are likely rich in opal. For opal to form, silicia rich rocks must interact with water. Now, researchers have dug into the Curiosity's rover's vast archive of images and found that these opal rich halos aren't isolated. Rather, they appear to exist all over Gale Crater, a 96-mile-wide ancient lake bed that Curiosity has explored since its mission began in 2012. Our new analysis of archival data showed striking similarity between all of these fracture halos we observed much later in the mission, a lead study author Travis Gabriel, a research physicist at the U.S. Geological Survey, said in a statement. Seeing that these fracture networks were so widespread and likely chock full of opal was incredible. Gabriel and his colleagues were studying all the images from Curiosity's Traverse around Gale Crater and noticed in an image taken much earlier in the mission a light halo of rock surrounding a fracture. That halo looked almost exactly like halos found more recently. A data from Curiosity's Chem Cam instrument, which analyzes rocks using images and spectrometry, showed that these recently studied light rocks likely contained silica rich opals. To confirm the chemistry of these rocks, Gabriel's team ran an additional analysis on the another set of fracture halos in a different location within the crater called the Lumbango drill site. Here, the team used Curiosity's dynamic albedo of neutrons instrument, which measures neutrons that are knocked off the Martian surface by cosmic rays, a high-energy particles from outside the solar system that constantly bombard Mars. These bouncing neutrons slow down in the presence of hydrogen, which is one of the main components of water. When DAN detects a higher proportion of slow-moving neutrons, that means there's more water-bearing rock 